Hi guys, I hope that you are doing well. It is GB from Inca Babes. And if this is your first time to my channel, welcome. And to my current subscribers, thank you guys so much for being here. Now I have had a few, not a lot, a few sales of my Tenzi savings challenge on my Etsy store. So I thought I would do a dedicated video on how to play Tenzi as well as some of the other uh, challenges. But this video for today is specifically going to be for Tenzi. I will do a separate video on how to play Shut the Box, and I will also do a separate video on how to play Rolling Riches. This one I definitely think I need to explain. So, so far, if you have been watching some of my videos, you will notice that I absolutely love playing the Tenzi Savings Challenge. As you may guess from the name 10Z, you are going to need 10 dice. So this is a dice game and you're going to need 10 dices. So here are my 10 dices here. I found these dices off of Amazon. I think I bought a pack of maybe a hundred and they come in a variety of colors. So you can definitely find some dices on Amazon, rather inexpensive. I typically usually play with my purple dice or I play with my pink dice because these two are our favorite colors. Okay, so first things first is you're going to need my Tenzi game savings challenge tracker found on my Etsy and you're going to need 10 dice. The rule of the games is pretty simple. All of your dices, your 10 dices need to have the exact same number in order for you to win the game. Now, this is inspired by the actual game called 10Z. You actually play the real game with multiple players, and the first person to get all of their dice is the same is the one that wins. But since this is a savings challenge inspired by 10Z, we actually can't play it that way. So I've come up with two ways that you can play 10Z. The first way, and this is the way that I've been playing it thus far, is that every time you roll your dice to get your number, you're going to play, you're going to have to save one euro or one dollar depending on where you're from all right so far i've had to roll 17 times both both of these times that i've played i had to roll 17 times um i ended up putting 20 euros both times because i don't have ones we don't have a dollar bill in europe we have coins and i don't like to use the coins so, so far I've managed to stick around that 17 mark. So this is a, this is a savings challenge that's actually might, you might have to save quite a bit on this challenge. Okay, so let's do the first way to play 10Z. What you want to do is get your 10 dices into your hand and you're going to shake them up. And here are all of the 10 dices. Your job is to think very smartly. Here I can see that the majority of the dices that have fallen are either sixes or ones. I don't have a three, I don't have a five. The challenge with this game is, even though I might be inclined to say, you know what, let's go for the sixes, or maybe let's go for the ones is, who's to say that more fives won't drop, or who's to say more threes won't drop? So it's a game of, really, it could go anyway. But for the sake of this tutorial, I'm going to stick with the sixes. So that was my very first roll, and that means I have to pay, or I have to save one dollar. Every time I roll, I will add one dollar onto this bill. So now it's time for my second roll, and for my second roll, I need to try to get as many sixes as possible. So let's give this a dice, let's give this a shake. Okay, great success. We have another six. We're going to add our six on. So we're halfway there. We don't have any more sixes, but we still have to add one dollar to our bill or one euro. Okay, now it's time to roll again. Ta-da! We have another six to add to our collection. I'm going to add one dollar to the bill and then we're going to roll again. Ta-da! Success! This game is being really nice to me today. I have another six to add to my collection. One dollar is added to my bill, or one euro. 
another six i think this game is showing off you guys on the camera i think it's trying to make you guys buy it go to my etsy store please support <laughs> we're gonna add one dollar to the bill so we're down to two dices guys so far we only have to save five euros five dollars but last time these two last two dices took so long to get to the magic number okay so we didn't get a six this time so we're gonna add one dollar to the bill we didn't get a six again we're gonna add one dollar to the bill we got a six absolutely amazing we're gonna add one dollar to the bill we are up to eight dollars let's see how long it takes for this last dice it's usually the last dice that costs me a lot of money in order to win this game okay one dollar added to the bill one dollar added to the bill oh that was so close one dollar added to the bill one dollar added to the bill another dollar oh my goodness see how it all adds up really quickly oh my goodness oh my goodness like usually it takes me 17. this one Seventeen again, seventeen again. I've been getting seventeen since I started playing this game. Okay, so so far that is all ten dices formed into our tenzi, and that is the first way to play the tenzi game. Okay, so the second way to actually play this is to give yourself sixty seconds to roll all of the dices. So you're actually going to go up against a timer. So you're going to have to be really fast because all of the dices that you don't actually get the number, you're going to have to save that. So you might save a lot of money doing it this way. So, okay, we're going to give ourselves 60 seconds. I've never done it this way before, so I'm actually pretty nervous. 60 seconds on the clock. Now. Okay, what do you have? Five, 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 five. Okay, great. So we have four fives. So we're going to, oh my gosh. Okay, five. Did we get any more fives? No, we didn't get any more fives. Wait, that was a five. Why did this move? It's taking away my time. Okay, let's go again. Did we get any fives? Yes, we got one five. Okay, great. Did we get any more fives? Yes, we got one five, yes. Okay, let's go. Did we get any more fives? No, we didn't get any fives on this round. Let's go really fastly. No fives on this round either. Oh my gosh. I'm going to have to... Oh, yes, we got another five. So we have three dice left. Yes, we got another five. Oh, my gosh. That's amazing. Uh, no. Nope. Three seconds, guys. Three seconds. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, my gosh. So uh, time ran out. So actually... Okay, so... These are the last two dices that landed, and it is a double six. So we actually would have to save 12. So actually, I would have saved more money if I did it this way. That was really fun. That was super fun. Okay, so those are the two ways that you can actually play Tenzi. I definitely recommend that you check my Etsy store out, purchase this game, play it. It is absolutely so much fun. Which one did you like? Racing against the clock? or paying one dollar or one euro every time you rolled let me know down in the comments okay until next time keep saving